guys Anthony here with Empire Music, empiremusic.com. You can reach me at the shop, 412-343-5299. You can email me directly at anthony at empiremusic.com with any questions you have. Bass, guitar, pedals, whatever. Hit me up, we're here. Um, today showing you another cool instrument out of the Fender lineup, specific for 2021. This is the 75th anniversary jazz bass. I have a video on the P bass that I just did, which is sitting right next to me here. We'll link those two together somewhere in the comments or, or in the description or in some tags up top here. If you're watching this on YouTube, feel free to subscribe to the channel. We always greatly appreciate that support. Really cool instruments. Um, these marry, these are Mexican made products. They come in around 850. They come with a gig bag, which is nice. And they marry sort of the player series stuff with the Ventera series stuff. So if you know the player series, that's like your standard issue instruments um, out of the Mexican series. Then the Ventera, a price point above that, marries uh, a lot of the vintage inspired kind of decade specific, era specific treatments that you would get out of instruments, whether we're talking basses or guitars. This kind of blends the two together very well. Uh, 60s pickups in them. So when I always you know, think of when it's a 60s J pickup is that really warm mid-range, not a ton of, not as much punch as we get from the 70s. So like the lower mid-range, a little bit more warm sounding where 70s gives you that upper mid-range, that, that, that real Marcus Millery kind of punch. You know, the 60s tend to mellow out a little bit, which I, I love. It's in the, the silver anniversary finish here, or the diamond anniversary finish to commemorate the 75th anniversary of Fender. So 1946 is when Leo Fender started the Fender Musical Instruments Company. Pretty crazy to think we're almost 100 years into that lineage, but you know, changing essentially uh, American music and music around the world forever with the, the advent of multiple instruments. So the 60s pickup in there, typical jazz bass setup. So you have volume, volume, and tone. It's a nine and a half inch radius on the neck. It is a modern C neck. So there we have what we get out of the player series, but with the vintage inspired pickups, we pull that kind of from the uh, Ventera series. So player series spec, Ventera series spec, kind of lands right in the middle price point and spec wise. Really cool instruments. What I was playing at the beginning there was both pickups wide open. I had tone probably around 70. Crank everything out here. So we're gonna go full pickup, uh, full pickup bridge, full pickup neck, tone all the way up and give you a couple of different sound examples. Oh, that was just bridge pickup. I thought that sounded a little bit too mid-rangey. Here, here we go. Full, full, full everything. Same thing with pick. just neck pickup so we get into P-Bass territory there.
scroll back just to the bridge. Man, full volume, full tone, uh, full volume on the bridge, full tone. tone off we'll go wide open take that tone back to about 60 yeah that sounds good front pick up like that. And we'll just do bridge pickup too. So bridge full, tone on 60. Typical jazz bass fashion, super versatile instrument, really gives you a touch of the modern, a touch of the old with the 60s inspired pickups. Great instrument. The 75th anniversary jazz bass from Fender. Anthony at EmpireMusic.com. You can email me directly. You can call me at the shop, 412 343 5299. Full factory setup on everything that we ship. 0% interest financing, all the stuff. Hit us up. Thanks for watching.